Good morning. This is Listen to VOA, Japanese English listening material site with transcript tips for a sustainable and connected future in the Edo era in 2030. Fire and quarrel are flowers of Edo. In the town of Edo, where the population exceeded 1 million and wooden houses were built closely, fires were so frequent that it was said that there were more than 2,000 cases in the Edo period alone including a large fire once every two or three years. Courtesy, humanity and patience. When a fire breaks out in Edo, these three are the creeds of the Edo kid, and they cannot be helped, especially. The town's people doing business want to help those who are burned out by the fire. He rushed to the spot to cook. One day, the stores began competing with each other, and the Edo kid was talking about which store ran first. In other words, it may have been just a volunteer, but acting quickly to snuggle up with the community to improve the credibility of the store and lead to business success. Asterisk 1 In times of crisis, the demand for business that contributes to the local community and ultimately to society may be the same in Edo and in the globalized world. Let's combine the creativity of private companies to meet the needs of future generations, Kofi Annan, the 7th United Nations Secretary General, called on the World Economic Forum in January 1999. At that time, social issues that could not be solved by governments and international organizations had already erupted. Mr. Annan urged companies to participate in solving the issues. He encouraged the world's top management to respond to the needs of future generations by conducting management from a long-term perspective. In the late 2000s, myopic pursuit of profits led to an economic crisis. Ad hoc businesses that lack the perspective of social issues will not last long. Throughout the era, companies have drawn even greater attitudes toward the future and are steadily working toward solving problems through open innovation. Despite the attitudes of Edo townspeople, Mr. Anand's foresighted appeal and lessons learned from the global economic crisis, there are still many challenges around the world. In an effort to protect the world from endless poverty, food crises, water scarcity and natural disasters, the international community has set Sustainable Development Goals SDGs, and committed the future to global efforts to solve them. According to the SDG's 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, we may be the last generation to have the opportunity to save the planet. If we succeed in this goal, SDGs, 2030 will be a better world. We call on the private sector to be creative and innovative in solving the challenges of sustainable development. In recent years, Society has been particularly demanding business solutions, and companies that can offer solutions are highly valued. The spread of ESG investment is symbolic. ESG information is a clue to corporate value that cannot be evaluated solely by sales or market share. Companies that have a firm vision of the environment, E, society, S and governance, g, from a long-term perspective have the ability to solve problems, are supported by society and are expected to grow sustainably. Even if you think that they should be in trouble because the penetration rate of electricity is less than what percentage, the numbers alone do not tell you the real needs. If you are in the field, you can understand the strength of the needs, Satoshi Akita, CEO of Washa, a venture company promoting a power sales business in Africa, is convinced. In Africa, many people still live without electricity. The population of this unelectrified area is not expected to change by 2030. In 2015, Akita started a business in Africa to rent LED lanterns, portable lighting fixtures, the lantern is charged with electricity generated by solar panels, and the lantern is provided to residents for a fee. In other words, this is an electricity sales business. In developed countries, people tend to assume that local people should be in trouble by seeing only low penetration of electricity infrastructure. But Akita says local people feel more valued by the family around the lights lit by cheap and readily available LED lanterns, rather than developing large investments in projects. 
It is the essence of the needs that cannot be understood unless you visit the site. Asterisk 2 There is a human-centered approach that starts with the value of the local people, snuggles up to people, and finds real challenges. In order for a person who thinks about business to be human-centered and who is the subject of living, to live more comfortably and with peace of mind, it is necessary to focus on aspects of human, such as human emotions and thoughts that are unique to human. That's all. Thank you. Listen to VOA.